Hey guys, Jupy here, bringing you another video, and today is Friday, so that means today is Top 5 Call of Duty Friday. So let's get right into it. As you see right here, today is the Top 5 Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Multiplayer Perks. So the Top 5 Perks, in my personal opinion, now out of the 18 that they are, obviously it's a bit different this time, since there's the selection slot, so like you, would ha you can't just like take perks like you always used to, but with like the new wild cards and everything so anyways let's get right into it with my number five okay so my number five is lightweight which in lightweight and black ops 2 it's a lot well it's not a lot different from the black ops 1 version of it basically you can move faster that is a part of it since there is no marathon in black ops 2 it, it does help you move faster it's the only perk in the game that actually helps you move faster now it also has you no fall damage which is the best part of the perk but i find it a good perk with not as good to always be using which is why it brings me to my number four perk which is hardline hardline in black ops 2 is a lot different than it was in black ops 1 in black ops 1 it only took off one kill from your kill streak and this you get bonus points for certain actions which let me rest at only use hardline if you're in an objective mode especially domination or capture the flag in games like Team Deathmatch or Kill Confirmed, well actually not in Kill Confirmed, but like in Team Deathmatch especially, it doesn't help you because you get bonus points. Like for an example, like getting a bone, like for flag capping and capture the pl flag, you get 250 points instead of 200, which helps you get to your different streaks, which is why I say this is especially good in Domination since you get a lot of points or even Search and Destroy where you get like 750 for defeat for like blowing up the bomb anyways let's get into my number three which is the first perk number three of the night which is dead silence absolute silence best perk ever when you're playing search and destroy like i love using this i use it particularly only when i need to since there's situations where like it's just a waste like i mean you can make your argument though you don't want people to hear you, but in Team Deathmatch, how many people are really worried about hearing people? For me, that's not a whole lot. Same as it's absolute silent. Like I said, it's great in Search and Destroy, but it's just, it's not that amazing that you want to always have it on. Which brings me to my number two, which is Toughness. Toughness is the only good perk two, in my opinion, which you want to always have on. Which, it makes you flinch less when you're shot, which makes you win pretty much all your gunfights as long as you're adequate and it's just it's amazing you always want to have it on like in any situation like i said you win just about every gunfight and win more gunfights especially playing like smg versus smg running and gunning kind of deal but it shouldn't make a difference because you always want to have this on but here we go my number one perk drum roll is hardwired yeah no i'm just kidding you my number one perk is tactical mask now if you're not too good at black ops or like haven't played it a lot you might not think of tactical mask because just about anybody who played black ops one for a while knows tactical mask is the worst thing that has ever existed in the history of games Seriously though, Black Ops 1, Tactical Mask makes you immune to the one grenade that no one uses, Nova Gas. <laughs> like seriously now people, what kind of perk do you want to use? Not that kind, but in Black Ops 2, it's much different. It makes you immune to flash and concussion grenades, shock charges too. Great for like just about anything. You can fool people into thinking that you're flashed, which is like the best thing ever. Like I was playing some search and destroy the other day. The people flashed me and they jumped through a window and I just smoked them. They thought I was like under their concussion or whatever. Nope. Best perk to always have on in my opinion. Unless maybe if you're playing search and destroy where dead silence could be more important. But I particularly run perk three greed both dead silence tactical mask if I'm running that class. But anyways, it's amazing like really you're just you're immune to grenades that pe to the three grenades that people actually use which is maybe the best thing ever seriously but anyways if you like this video please drop a like it helps me out a lot and subscribe if you want to see some more content check my channel next friday for the new top five which i will announce on my facebook page which is in the description of this video and as always i am jupy and i will see you later